Well, Sun located about 152.09 km away from Earth. Not just a distance, but about 109 times larger than Earth. And you all know, our solar system created about 4.5 billion years ago. Currently, we have 8 planets. Sorry, Pluto. But what if I tell you, Sun was not born alone? Scientists speculate that when our solar system formed, there was another Sun. But why did it go? Why is there no sign of that today? In today's video, we will discuss or try to find out where is the Sun's lost twin. We don't know exactly how big our solar system is. The center of the solar system is the Sun. A number of dwarf planets are known to exist beyond our solar system and are thought to have a giant spherical cell behind them, which is known as Oort Cloud. But it has never seen directly, but scientists believe it exists. According to scientists, it is about 1.6 light years away from the Sun. Our solar system was formed 4.5 billion years ago from an interstellar gas and dust. Later, this gas started to rotate centrally. Gravitational forces pulled more material to the center and the pressure was so great that the hydrogen began to turn into helium, releasing a large amount of energy. And after that, our sun was formed from them. Planets are formed from the remaining gas and dust left behind. But here is the main question. Was our sun born alone? New research Howard University suggests that almost all stars are born in pairs, including our own. There are many such stars in space which are not alone like Sirius and Cygnus X1. Before that, let's know what double star system or multi star system is. In a double star system or a binary star system, two stars orbit each other at a fixed distance. But it does not mean that two stars will be the same shape or the same temperature or the same brightness. These binary stars can be seen in 85% of space. More than half of all stars in the sky have one or more partners. But what is ours? According to scientists, our sun also had a twin sister, or you can say a cruel sister. Although present in the first case, later it gradually drips away. However, according to some scientists, the sun had not one but many twins. But sometimes circling they dripped away like eternity. Maybe that's what happened to our sun. But some astronomers said that this cruel twin is not good for us at all. Because according to scientists, the last time this giant celestial object came closer to the sun, the dinosaurs extinct from the Earth. Maybe the Sun's twin or Sun 2.0 still orbiting our Sun from about 1.5 light years away. It is a red dwarf star which we cannot see. According to scientists, the Sun took all gas from the molecular cloud during the formation of the solar system and the twin or Sun 2.0 had none of that. Then it gets pushed back for some reason and now it is nowhere to be seen. According to scientists, maybe this star is so far away that we don't think it's orbiting our sun or it lost in Milky Way for forever. Or maybe the star has reached the end of its life, having exhausted all its fuel and becoming a neutron star or a black hole. According to many, it may not have been a star but rather a Jupiter-like but massive planet. There is something beyond the Neptune's orbit that has gravitational effects on Neptune's orbit. According to some, it is a planet or a black hole or the twin of the sun. This star has a name, Nemesis. If you look at the fossil record or the history of the Earth, you will see that various terrible events including mass extinction come in circular way. So according to scientists, whenever this star comes closer to the Sun, this happens on Earth, like tsunami or an asteroid strike. But after many attempts, the existence of this star or black hole or neutron star is not found. Just because we didn't find this hypothetical star doesn't mean our star didn't have a twin. According to scientists, many stars were born at the time to give birth to the sun. Although scientists haven't found it yet, they have now found some possible ones like 18 Scorpii. 18 Scorpii is a solitary star located about 46.1 light years away from Earth. According to scientists, it may be the lost twin of the sun. As you can see, this star with the naked eye, this star is moving backwards. It is very similar to our sun and is about the same age as the sun. SD 197027 is probably next twin of our sun. It is located about 255 light years away. Its brightness, size and temperature are almost that of the sun. Scientists think it might be the sun's twin. But so far, we have not found the sun's twin. 4.5 billion years ago, our solar system formed and with it, this sun and its twin sun 2.0 formed. 
but then due to various cosmic events those twins are scattered in different parts of the milky way today it is almost impossible to find it although it is a sad story as a result of such sacrifices of the sun 2.0 our solar system is stable today and there is so much good that life is created on earth life might not have been created today if the sun's twin was with the sun so consider us lucky or not because according to the fossil record destruction has occurred on earth every 25 million years so is the sun's twin orbiting the sun in the oort cloud or far away where we can't see it or the sun's twin has long ago disappeared somewhere in the milky way The cause of this destruction is not the sun sister but a giant planet or black hole or neutron star. There will be a separate video about what is at the end of the solar system. But for now, keep watching some of the scariest planets in space or some real pictures of our solar system.